All right, y'all, so look, bro. Everybody has been telling me, DNA, you always teach us all these methods, but you never put it to use. So in this series, seven days in a row, all right? Seven days in a row. What I'm gonna be doing every single day is try to make money from zero dollars up to 10,000, all right? So from this series, it will provide you a lot, bro. You can actually learn some valuable things. You can, you know what I'm saying, find this as entertainment. You can laugh a little bit. You know what I'm saying? This it, this series is basically an all-in-one, you know what I'm saying? So I'm going to put my methods to the test and try to make $10,000 in the most legit way possible. You know, I'm going to show every single dollar with the most transparency just to show that if I can do it, y'all can do it too because if i'm starting from zero dollars what is the excuse now bro everyone's making all the excuses oh i'm in this country i can't do this i'm in that bro i live in canada all right first of all we do not have no tiktok creativity program so that's already scratched off the list we don't have a lot of access to a lot of things so we gotta just scratch off a lot of things also to mention this is in seven days, right? I don't have all the time in the world, so we gotta scratch off YouTube monetization because I can't really monetize any channel on Instagram, Snapchat, TikTok, YouTube, anything in the span of time, all right? So cut that off the list. Also, the two methods that make me the most money in real life, I have to scratch off the list because that, those also take a lot of time. Reselling and the affiliate method. Reselling, obviously, I can't order stuff to come in in time to sell it because it already takes two weeks to come in from China, so scratch off that list. The affiliate method, it takes way too long for people to just send in stuff, and if I'm doing everything from scratch, I also gotta restart from zero followers and zero subscribers, oh all right? So that'll be too hard, so I'm gonna scratch that off the list. No social media at all, just straight making money. So think about it. What would you do if you were given a task and you had no idea how to do it? I don't know about y'all, but I speak from experience. I'm going to chat GPT, bro. So let's go, bro. Let's go. All right, bet we are here at the setup. As you can see, I asked ChatGPT to give me some methods. And to be honest, it's not looking that good, bro. Freelance tat, like, bro, what is this? Car wash. All right, I could low-key try that. Pet services, like, bro, who do I look like? Tutoring. Bro, <laughs> is that racist? But no, anyways, all these are just so unrealistic. Like, bro, content creation. Like, bro, come on, bro. Stop playing with me. I can't even monetize nothing. Garage sale. Bro, we are not in the 1980s. Anyways, bro, I think we're going to scratch this. Bro, I, th I really thought ChatGPT would come through. But nah, these are just kind of ass. Personal shopping. Like, bro, I'm trying to make... I'm trying to run up 10 bands bro this is not working you know what i'm gonna just stick to what i'm good at and use my own methods so i did come up with a list of methods i'm gonna read it out real quick all right so from my little list of methods by the way this can change i'm gonna just use these methods for now uh just just to just to lock it in you know i write a lot of stuff in my notes so i'm gonna just lock in these methods that i'm gonna use throughout the seven days all right number one nba playoff betting it is the nba playoffs and i, I do kind of watch a little bit of nba so I'm gonna definitely do a little bit of betting. Number two, scam kids on Roblox, all right? So I do play a little bit of Roblox, so why not just scam kids for their Robux? Third option, trade up challenge. I know you guys seen on YouTube, trade up from a penny, trade up from a paperclip. I might do that, whip out the camera, convince people to give me better items for freaking lower quality items and just keep trading up. Four, mystery box method. If y'all don't know the mystery box method, what you do is basically get a box like this, Get a box like this, cover it up with literally nothing inside of it and sell it to people for like 10 or five bucks. You know what I'm saying? I could do that a couple times. It's kind of evil, but it's a mystery box at the end of the day. Number five, offer to do people's homework. I could offer to do people's homework. I mean like school is almost ending where I'm from. So school is ending in like the next month. So I could offer to do people's homework for money. I'm also Asian. So I do have the freaking um, requirements because I'm just Asian. I'm good at math and shit like that. So W method. Next one, hit the casino. I'm definitely gonna hit the casino. I might actually do it multiple times, but definitely on the last day, y'all better stay tuned for the last day because on the seventh day, I'm gonna be betting everything I have at the casino to see if I make a lot of money. So yeah, that's gonna be a good one. And then the last one, uh, I might actually start out with this method. It's called the Facebook furniture method. And I can do that with multiple items, you know what I'm saying? What I basically do is go to my Facebook. I think I might actually do this right now. Go to open up my Facebook and stuff like that. Go to marketplace, search up the word free, you know what I'm saying? And everything around my area, I can pick up these free things, like a free couch and stuff like that. And I might actually just start reselling free furniture or free items. 
just to get a little bit of money and then use that money to get even more money. So I think this is a good startup. I could definitely run up a couple hundred dollars today. You know what I'm saying? So I'm going to try to do this method today. Get a couple hundred dollars. Obviously, it's not livable because you can't find good stuff every day and resell it on the same day. So I think getting it won't be hard. It's just the fact that I have to resell it. So we're going to try this method out. Uh, I think I'm going to get like at least eight free things because there's no way I don't sell one. So we're going to start with that method. No cap. And we're going to get right into it. All right, y'all. It's like a couple hours later. I've been texting so many people. And today, it's like pouring rain out. So... I don't know if I'm able to like even pick up stuff, but this is what it's looking like, bro. I've so far found technology, um, a lot of technology, like Ikea shelves. I got couches and stuff like that. I'm texting everyone and I did get a couple responses for pickup. The only problem is that they're very far and it is a tornado watch today. So I have no idea how much money I'll make today. I'm going to try to, I'm going to try to make as much as possible, but I'm about to go right now to pick up a RCA monitor. Apparently it's worth like $80 because I searched, like, I searched up the exact same thing on a Facebook marketplace and apparently people are selling it for $80. So I'm going to go pick it up for free and see if I can sell it. That'll be my item number one. I might go pick up some more furniture and stuff like that throughout the day if people respond. So I'm going to let y'all know. And yeah, I'll see y'all in a little minute when I pick it up. All right, y'all. So I'm about to go to the dude's crib. He's not too far from me, so I'm walking. But as you can see, this is like the tornado aftermath. Bro, it's really bad out today. So I'm going to go and see what's up with that. We are back. Oh my gosh, bro. Just check this out. We got the RCA monitor free i mean it looks kind of old and it's like obviously not brand new but i'm gonna do a little i'm gonna do a little unboxing right here for y'all come on let's see it let's see it you can see it's like old used but it comes with the controller all right i don't want to mess up the packaging or anything let me try to take it out or i think yeah this is the thing you put the monitor on and as you can see here i'm gonna try to as you can see right there is the monitor bro it's nothing too crazy. I think the details are like all on the front and stuff. Like here, as you can see, these are the details. 19 inch LED TV. You know, it can, you can't go wrong. It doesn't even look that bad. Still has the box and stuff, which I'm wondering like, why would you give it for free? Maybe this dude just couldn't sell it, but I'm gonna try my best to sell it. With my marketing tactics, all right? I'm gonna go step by step and try to sell this. Cause as soon as I can sell this, bro, I can start betting in the NBA playoffs, bro, with this money. So I'm going to let y'all know how it goes. I'm going to take the pictures and stuff and post it. So yeah. All right, y'all. So I just uploaded the the pictures and stuff. Look at these. Be look at this beautiful camera work, bro. Hold on. So as you can see, that's the pictures. I added um, all angles, basically the box. You know what I'm saying? The box and everything like that. The packaging. And I listed it for $60, all right? So I don't know nothing about no monitors or whatever, but all I know is I'm finna put it for a high price, right? And then since no one is gonna buy it for that high price, I'm gonna put it down because Facebook Marketplace, they show when items get discounted. So if I put it down to 40, it's gonna be like, yo, it used to be 60, now it's 40. So that'll make people wanna buy it. So I'm gonna let that marinate, you know what I'm saying, on day one. I don't know if I'm gonna make money off of it today, but I'm gonna just let it marinate for day one. And then tomorrow is when I drop the price listing, which most of the time, that's that's the that's the part when everyone starts te texting about it all right so i'm just locking trust the process and i'm gonna see if i can get a hold of another item but so far bro I, i'm liking this bro i'm liking this like so far we only have assets we don't have money but that's okay you know what i'm saying because because eventually it'll sell and if not i didn't lose nothing because i got it for free you feel me so i'm gonna try it out with the next couple items but can i just point something out on the profile that I posted this listing for this thing, I also have my other listings for what I actually sell because I do kind of sell a little bit on Marketplace. But since I had it previously, it's not counting to the towards this challenge. But as you can see, bro, a Mary shirt, vape shirts, you know what I'm saying? I'm literally stocked up on everything, bro. What is this? Essentials. Bro, I got spider hoodies, bro. Spider hoodies on spider hoodies, bro. I got freaking everything. But unfortunately all these items here will not count towards this challenge because it's what i had beforehand so this is gonna be really hard sell something there it just does not count it has to be the stuff in this challenge which i got and sold in the challenge so yeah i'm gonna hit y'all if i get any more updates but i just i'm honestly looking to get a hold of any amount of money so i can just start betting you know what i'm saying 
All right, y'all, so I'm gonna pop up the conversation on screen right now, but basically I've been talking to this dude. He wants to pick it up for $20 less, all right? I'm fine with that because I was gonna put it down at 40 anyways. Gave him my address, as you can see on the screen, and um, I'm about to meet him in like an hour and a half. So hopefully, once I sell this, I'll have money to invest in other things and you know what i'm saying just start out my journey right there but i'd rather do this than go outside and actually make money because first of all i live in a dead area there's nobody outside and then second it's rainy bro it's, it's hella rainy I, I, my plan was to go outside and sell stuff or just go in public and try to make money but today i don't know if i'm gonna be going out in public i might just be you know what i'm saying it might just be my day one just just doing like just reselling you feel me but i'm gonna update i'm gonna update y'all if this guy actually pulls up and yeah, I'm gonna see y'all in a little minute. All right, so the dude didn't pull up. Psych, boy, we got forty dollars, and you're probably wondering, DNA, why are you whispering? It's because I don't want my dad to know that I'm about to spend this forty dollars on the freaking Mavericks game, bro. On this Mavericks game, you feel me? I'm about to bet money. I secretly downloaded the betting app, which is right here, Bet365. And apparently, if you bet for the first time on this nba game you get 30 percent profit all right so by that i would need to have a combined three three plus selections of 100 plus or greater which i don't think i'm gonna do that because it's just really risky so i'm gonna just go with a safe bet and if i do deposit 10 bucks i think i get a free 50 or some shit like that i don't know i'm gonna explain you all the details but i'm just messing around on the app you know i just made my account right here as you can see why DNA, bro? There's so much thing, I, bro. I didn't even start doing the app, and I'm already addicted. Like, look at this, bro. Right here, I have an option to get out of the the whole games and just straight go to the casino. I don't need to, I don't need to leave my seat to play black blackjack. So, yeah. Even there's a a mini roulette. You know, I might put in ten, and then I get a free fifty, so I can bet the whole thing. Plus, I still have this. I'm finally happy, bro. That counter finally went up to 40, and we'll see how much I go up today. I have a lot of shit planned for the rest of the week, basically. I spread it out evenly. Today was just more of a planning day, but uh, I'm gonna get to y'all when I finish setting up my whole account, and I'm gonna show y'all my bets. All right, y'all, so right now I'm about to run blackjack. I can't believe I'm saying this, bro. I actually fell off, but I might run a game. I never done this before. I'm trying to play like the spinny thing, American Rula. I think this is the right one. I just bet two dollars and eight cents on red. Let's go. Let's go. Let's go. Why is it not showing me? Oh yeah, there we go. Two dollars and eight cents on red. We just won. To oh my god. Yo, we just won two dollars and eighty cents. Oh my gosh. I'm backing out. I'm backing out. Here, I just put my winnings on red. Let's go, shorty. Come on, let's go. Come on, bro. I don't know why I'm like, it's only two dollars. We just went up. We're at fourteen. We're at fourteen eighty. I just bet two dollars again on red. I put two dollars on red. Let's go again, bro. After after this one, I'm pulling out. I don't care if I lose or win. I'm gonna pull out. I don't care. Lose or win. Nah, bro, I gotta, I gotta spin back, bro. I gotta spin back, bro. I put two more. Come on, red gang. You know we crept out. All right, we're back to, we're back to the 14. All right, I'm out, I'm out, I'm out, I'm out. All right, as you can see on my screen right now, our balance is 14. Yo, red never fails. Red never fails. Oh my gosh. All right, now what we doing? What we doing? Seven? Nah, I'm gonna put like 50 cents on that. I don't know why I just did. I don't even know why I just did. Yeah, that was a bad. Why'd I do that, bro? What? Three on black. Stop playing with me. Let's go. Let's go. I just doubled it. Yo, we at 20 now. Oh my gosh, we're at 20. I bet. Let me do the same thing. Let me do the same thing, bro. Oh, oh, oh. We just ran it up. We're at 22. I might just end it right now. Nah, I'm on a roll. I'm on a roll. I can't. 
I just put four in black and that's it. I promise you that's it. I can't end on a loss, bro. There's no way, bro. I can't end on a loss. Let's go. All right. 22.30. I'm a cash. I'm going to just go out, bro. We out. We out. We out. You know what I'm saying? As you can see, that is the price that we ending with. I'm gonna just add that to I'm gonna add that to the 30 because if you do the math, I spent 10 on this, which minus is from the 30. But now we're adding 22 30, so we up now. That's day one. But trust me, it'll be way more tomorrow because that's when we're actually going to public. So hey, this is more of a try not to get addicted to gambling challenge. But we out here. Make sure you hit the like and sub button. A new video. I think it'll be. I'll upload every two days just so I have time editing. So the next one in two days. And we out here, bro.